um, this is my first vlog for Signet. Um, currently down at a new venue for me. Down at we're down at Chilston Farm Stour. You guys might know it as Mid Kent Stour. Uh, it's recently was bought by a guy called Mark. He's a fish farmer. Um, he's done a lot of work to it. I come down in the winter, probably in January time, and it was how Mid Kent had it. Uh, I haven't been down since. It's my first trip back down here in a while. Uh, done a lot of work. The swims are all been new swims put in. Uh, he stocked it with a load of his own fish. And the fish he put in are uh, awesome little things. Uh, put them in from like mid doubles up to low twenties. They're all real scaly, like proper small heads, big bald nose, like bald noses, big shoulders. Oh, they look awesome. But the original stock in here is just fantastic. It's just like uh, uh, real jet black, real scaly, fully scales, linears. Um, they're just old creatures, they're proper old, old, old warriors. I'm looking forward to getting stuck into them. Um, but yeah, so we'll see how this session goes. Hopefully, I can get amongst them. Uh, and I shall be back for you in a bit. See you later. decided not to rejoin Golden Gates for a couple of reasons. I've done five years up there, caught a few, kept getting recaptures and life's too short to be chasing one carp so I've put that to bed and just want something new and exciting. I think this is gonna be gonna be just that like um, so yeah. I'm going to get the kettle on. Right, it's now quite late in the afternoon. Still not had anything, but to be honest, I've not really been looking. I'm going to be uh, honest with you, I had a little bit of siesta -er earlier. My hay fever is horrendous and it's making me feel like crap, so I thought well, I'm going to go to sleep. Um, but I've seen one since I've been up, quite a way out there towards the uh, the hut to my left, sort of in in front of the oaks water. Um, one of the guys come up, come up from just up to me from me left. He had a walk up, said he just lost one due to the weed up his line. Oh, the pike there. Um, I might have a rechuck in a bit. Reel him in, have a rechuck. It's getting quite. I don't know what the time is now? It's about. Was it five? Just gone five. So yeah, I'll reach up and then probably make some dinner. And yeah, we'll be back with you in a bit. Well into the evening now, um, it's got to be gone 
7 o'clock. Um, I'm having dinner, a nice pizza with the Ridge Monkey. Um, I'd reach up with the rods, put a little bit more bait out. Um, but a couple of liners, like, I've soaked my uh, bait in fossil, in mainline's fossil, and um, I've had a slick come up on my spot. Uh, there's a lot of tension here, so I should imagine they've moved in on the spot. So I've got sweet corn in there as well in the mix. Um, hopefully, hopefully tonight, I'm moving on the spot. The guy opposite me has had two now. Um, he's, he's not fishing like in the middle. He's quite quite short in front of him, so they're sort of more his side. Hopefully they're. Uh, and move over. The guy, like, opposite, the guy to the left lost one earlier. He's fishing like right, up, right up to his left. So they must be well spread out. Um, I hope I get the first bite. Uh, yeah. yeah. Got all three rods out of the spot now. Straight out in front. The last spot I found this morning. So yeah, hopefully this, I'll uh, be able to report in the morning with a fish. Morning all. God, a bit of a nightmare last night. The reason for only being one rod there is the fish started to spawn again and they decided to start spawning about 10 yards out in front of me. So my rod line was literally in their way and it was literally all night. Did, 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 did. So I did the right thing and reeled my rods in. Not much sleep. I'm absolutely naked. Um, guy in the oaks up to my left. He's just gone out in the boat to retrieve a fish. Um, don't know what he's had. Might go up and have a look. Oh, uh, God, I'm knackered. I've got enough to put a kettle on, I think. Think about what I'm going to do. I might cut the session short. He spawned, but they've stopped now. It was all night, relentless they were. So yeah, nothing to report this morning. See what happens today. I'll come back to you in a bit. Right then, guys. Only got to fluke one out. The fish have been rolling in front of me. And, uh, I thought I had to do something about it, so it's really weedy in front of me. So I tied up a couple of naked shots, flinged them out in the weed, nice high shots. About 15 minutes later, it's rattled off 21 pounds on the nose. Proper beat me up. Behave. Yes. Proper dark on stout corner. Love it. Angry old male this one. Fuck up. So made up. So made up. Save the blank. Oh, well, no bite then. That line has been savage. Um, but yeah, just put that comment back. Um, so I have a fresh rig, got the rod back out. Um, you're literally sitting there tidying the rig box up and stuff, and it's gone again. 
Ooh. Minus. Uh, yeah, it's gone again. Jumped in the water, playing it, I can see it's a dark old mirror. It wasn't doing a great deal. It's sort of just wallowing about. Could have been a good fish. So the ones that get away always are a good fish. Um, went on a massive run. So caught the way out into the lake, just, just couldn't stop it. And then the hook just pinged out. Oh, and you just think, oh, for God's sake, just heart sinks but they're there still I'm getting the liners as you can see I I get a, new, a new one another one so yeah looking forward to it I had a little bit of a change I've uh, stuck two naked chods on I was fishing a spot out there about 50 yards over a load of bait nothing's come nothing's occurred from it I'm standing at the front of the swim and I see two fish individual fish just swim past quite close in above the weed and uh, I thought I got to catch them all. so I thought I'd tie up a couple of naked chods and put some stinky plates on them and I flicked one to the left one to the right and it slackened off oh, ripped off okay, that's turning up yeah ripped off so yeah I'm well chuffed first blood from the new pond Hopefully more to come. See you in a bit. Right, that's me done. Um, hopefully get back down here next week. Only ended up with two the two bites. One twenty pound common and I lost that decent looking mirror. Um, so I'll be back down here next Saturday. Hopefully all going well. Um, yeah, and hopefully I can get amongst them again. Uh, show sure how busy it's going to be next week, there's a few coming out now, so yeah, we'll uh, see what next week brings, I hope you enjoyed the vlog, tight lines, see you later.